Hi, this is Susan. A couple of you have asked me to um, record a video about how to order groceries online, so here it is. Um, a couple of things before we start. I'm ordering, I'm going to do this video about ordering from Mega, uh, the Mega Supermarket. So here's the website, mega.co.il. So you might want to go there now and, um, and, and look at the site for yourself. Um, you can um, you can also keep open all the time Google Translate, which is translate.google.com. Okay, this is um, a, a wonderful tool which I use all the time. It's getting better and better with with more and more people using it. And uh, basically, I put in something I don't know, like this phrase from the mega site, and it tells me what it means in English. So, uh, you know, likewise, if you have an English word and you're not sure how to, um, how to write it in, in uh, Hebrew, how, what to look for in Hebrew, um, you can, you can do, you know, type in the English and find the Hebrew word. So the, the biggest um, hurdle, obviously, with ordering online is that everything is in Hebrew and you have to get used to what they call things here. And sometimes that requires a little bit of research, but it's definitely worth it, especially because once you register, they keep a list of everything you've ever ordered uh, in your account. So after the first time you make an order, every item you worked so hard at figuring out to, to purchase stays on your list, and you can just look at your list from last time and and that will, and uh, they will add whatever you order the second time to that list. That list gets just gets bigger and bigger, and that makes it very easy to order after the first time you order. So, with Mega, you register, you choose your groceries. Um, this is the list of grocery departments, and we'll go through that. This is the um, going to be where you will see your, your grocery cart over here somewhere once you start ordering and that will be a uh, keep to ta totaling up on um, your um, purchase, the total of your purchase and when you check out you will choose a time and date of for the delivery. So um, and you know here's the, the Hebrew of what I just said. Okay register, uh, put things in your cart, um, choose a date and it comes it comes to you okay so the first thing you're going to have to do is register so you'll click here and I think you can probably figure out um, what this is you know your first name your family name where you live um, your email address here uh, you have to choose a username and a password and then type your password in again and then click here that you agree to all their conditions and then uh, build your cart. Benasol, sol, I guess that means. Um, and that just means, you know, okay, start start buying. So since I'm already a registered user, and I hope I'm not going too fast, but that's why this is on video, so you can go back and look at it. Um, once you've registered, you have a username and password, and this is a Likuach Kayam, which means existing user. So I'll type in my username and my password and go into the site okay so uh, this is because I started a cart and um, closed it that's what that message was but anyway let's disregard that um, so let's say um, this is your first time buying and you don't know where anything is or how to do this so let's take it very easily um, this is the list of, of food departments. So um, I think you can probably figure out most of this. It's eggs and milk products. Your rakot v'peirot, fruits and vegetables. Meshka'ot, drinks. Basar v'dagim. Shomrim afiyav v'bishul, which is shimorim, which is like products for baking and cooking. Um, cleaning um cleaning supplies um which is like um candies and uh, bars or like uh, you know power bars kind of thing 
lechem, ma'afim, bread and baked goods, salatim, the niknakim, so that's salads and like deli. Uh, kifuim is everything that's frozen. I learned that word very quickly once I once I started ordering online. The tinok shali, baby stuff. Yofi ve'tipoch, so that's beauty stuff. Uh, Deganim ve cornflakes is cereal and cornflakes. Um, Briyut for organi, which is their organic stuff. And uh, this is for uh, this is for pet food. Okay, down here Bale Chaim. Okay, so let's say the first thing you want to do is is and, and I encourage you to spend time with this because the more you use it, um, the happier you'll be and the more you'll recognize what you need to do. So just click um, Beitzim and Motzrei Chalav, and you see here you get Beitzim. Okay, so you click on Beitzim. Okay, so this is giving you an example of the kind of eggs you can order. You can have 12 eggs large, 12 eggs extra large, 12 eggs medium, um, 12 eggs large, and it's a different, um, a, a, you know, you can look at what that what that means. I don't know, and it's okay. Um, so, you know, you basically can figure it out. If there are more items in this section, they're going to have this here to say here, uh, to click here for more items in this section. So here was one more item in this section. Okay, so let's say you want... Uh, a dozen extra large eggs. You click this, Hosaf Lasal, add this to my cart. You click that, and then if you want two dozen, you just hit the plus, and voila, two dozen eggs appears in Ha'agala Shali. Okay? Now, right here, it might scare you, it says that it's going to be delivered uh, tomorrow between 11 and 2. But you can change that when you um, when you check out, so don't don't pay attention to that yet. Okay, so then let's go to milk products. Okay, now here, okay, there are different categories. Okay, this is these gvina milcha, salty cheeses, and these are like spicy cheeses. Um, and what you need is your yellow cheeses, and they show you a few items, and then they tell you to click here to see the whole range in this category, and then you can see there is a much bigger range in this category. In fact, there's two pages. So let's say you want this cheese, and as soon as you clicked on it, it added it to your, the it put it on the top of the page, your list of your list this is your cheese okay now let's go back to the list these are all this is under Motzrei Chalav it opens up into all of these options here's yogurt and again you know your Hebrew, your Hebrew is good enough trust me you look down the list play with it a little bit and you'll get used to it and alternatively you can type in at the top you can type in the word yogurt, right, and and that will show all of the options for yogurt, and then you can choose from there. Um, for those of you who don't have Hebrew um, on your computers, um, the the best thing to do is to go here into Google Translate, type the word in English, yogurt, and then copy. This, copy the Hebrew, control C, and then type it, control V, into here. So you don't really need a Hebrew to be able to type in Hebrew to, to find what you need. And I hope I'm, I'm not going too quickly, but I wanted to give you the full feeling of what it means to order. It really isn't as complicated as it feels, mostly because everything has a picture. So you're not going to order something you don't want. Um, oh, well, that's not true. I've ordered that many times, but it's kind of funny. And um, and also, you have the Google Translate, so you can find the Hebrew word if you want. Okay, now let's go into fruits and vegetables. Okay, here we have dried fruits and vegetables and nuts. Here we have dates. 
So you can see each section here divides, um, um, drops down into a bigger selection under that word. So Yurakot Vipeirot has three off offerings under it. Beit Sima Motzrei Chalav has three offerings, and then under those has more. So obviously that's a very, very big section. And a lot of this is, um, you play with it. You know, you're not quite sure um, what something's called. You're not quite sure if you're ordering the right thing. It's kind of a little bit exciting and fun. So let's say you've ordered everything you want. I think it has to be at least 150 shekel of an order to um, to actually order something, to actually get your delivery. So I'm going to add some things. I'm going to add... Um, oil or fats or whatever these are, shimarim. Um, I'll just add a lot of things so I can I can get the uh, cart up to enough money. Okay, and now I'm ready to pay and tell them what day I want it delivered. So once you finish going through this whole thing, and it might take you a while, it'll get better um, as time goes on, and obviously after the first order, you'll have your Rishima, your list of everything you've ordered, so you won't have a problem. You'll be able to just pick from that list. Okay, so once you're finished ordering, go to Agala Shali. Okay, and here's your list. Of course, they make suggestions for other things, and they have Mitzaim, like they do in the regular store, so you could check those out as well. Um, now here, if you have a coupon of some sort, sometimes they email you once you've registered, you get emailed coupons. And this is where you would put your coupon in. It says uh, Hazan Coupon. So you'd click on this, and then you would type in the whatever numbers or symbols are on the coupon. Say um, uh, Hosif Coupon. They would add it, and then, um, and then you would get that coupon deducted. Okay, so here's my list. I can delete things here. Okay, um, it's came to 180 shekel and 70. Okay, I, here's my um, my delivery charge of 28 shekel. Okay, and now I want to pay. So I go to the Tashlum. Okay, okay. Now here's the information I put in my registration, um, or this maybe comes up the first time that you order. Um, you put in your address, the street, your apartment, the floor you're on. The entrance of the building is which floor. They want to know that. And your phone number. And then they ask you where do you want it delivered. So I always choose, I that put it in my profile that I always want door. They can they can bring it to the door. They can bring it, um, they can leave it outside your door if you want. Um, so you have a lot of different options there. And then here are what, here are some options about uh, what happens if they don't have something you've ordered. Okay, um, you can leave this blank, or you can leave it at its default. Um, they'll say send me um, alternative items if you don't have you know what I want. But first, um, but don't, and don't call me. And sometimes the and the one option is. Uh, please call me and, and we'll discuss the options. Uh, so you can choose any of those. All right. Um, they want you to uh, send, I want them to send it to the door. You can say, buy it prati, kanisa miyamin. You can tell them the details of, of the entrance, like, you know, down two steps and off to the right. It's complicated. And here is your time for ordering. So. Tomorrow you can choose 11 to 2, uh, 3 to 6, or 6 to 9. Um, and same thing for, um, for the next day. Usually they only give you two days in advance. If you, if you put an order in in the morning, it's possible you can get it that afternoon. So can think about that. Okay. Uh, and when you're finished with all of this, you continue. Oh, that's it. Let's just have to choose this. Okay. And then this is your, your payment. This is what information you've put in there to, to pay. 
and then I'm not going to go any further because then I won't have paid and then the next step is to actually pay. So that's the basics. Um, I'll just go over it another time just for the basics. Um, you register. You can look up your entire list of items you've ordered and choose from there. After your first couple times, you might have everything in there. If you need to navigate this, this is the sort of the, the most difficult part because you don't always know what something's called. Um, and in that case, I suggest using Google Translate. Um, you, you place your order for whatever you want. Your cart fills up with your total. And then when you're ready, you go to your Agala and you go through the payment process. So I hope that this has helped you. Um, if you have any suggestions for anything else I can teach you about this, please let me know. I'm happy to do it. It's pretty easy to make a video. And happy shopping. Bye.